What's up, people? Joshua Woodruff. Hey, I was thinking about how this nation and, and the earth is uh, is run by the elite and what their agenda is, and they want they want us to be servants of theirs, right? And there is no politician, there is no king or queen or sultan or anybody that's going to save us, right? There's no one. Donald Trump ain't going to do it. Nobody's going to do it. Trump is just as evil, worse evil. And a lot of y'all don't like hearing that. But he's playing the same. He's part of the same team as Biden. Same team. With the same agenda. They're just getting to it a different way. They they had to release the boogeyman, right? They had to show all of this. They had to show all of this poison and all of this uh, corruption so that you would get on board with hiring a hero to fix it, right? And that's Donald Trump. Well... If there's a hero, there's no one to stand up to take his place, right? Because somebody's already taken care of it. Like the floor needs to be swept and somebody's sweeping it. Well, you're not going to sweep the floor. Somebody's already sweeping it. Same thing. Donald Trump doesn't have the power to change this. No, Nobody has the power to change this except for you. You and me. And all the rest of us. We outnumber them a thousand to one. We have all the power, we have all the control, we just don't use it because we've been so indoctrinated that we think we're living free and that Donald Trump's going to save us or the next one's Ronald Reagan or this one or that one. No, they're all part of the same freaking team. That's what you got to understand. They're literally related by blood and none of them are going to fix it. It's, it's you and I. And the only way we can do that is, is to say no to a lot of stuff. Don't pay your taxes. Don't pay your tickets. Just say no. Like with these new new tax laws and new, new, um, new uh, policies and ordinances. No. Say no. They can't do it. it. Literally, we can. So what was it? A few months ago was uh, somewhere in Asia, I think. Man, they ran. They ran the parliament out, or, or whatever form of government they had. They, they, they literally got together, walked in, and ran them out of office. Ran them out of there. We can do the same thing. Like if everybody that showed up on court for traffic for Somerdale, right? Because they make like thirty thousand dollars a week off of traffic tickets. If if everybody that showed up for court said, "Hey, ain't not one of us paying these tickets. It's unreasonable." For what? For a policy? It's not a law. We didn't break a law. You you have have done something that is illegal, right? Can't enforce a policy on I me. Mean, so if everybody got together and said, we're not going to pay these tickets, we're not going to pay these taxes, what are they going to do? Nothing. They, they, they're, it's like we, so it's like an adult and a child, right? A child only does what you allow them to do. Well, it's a little different with us. Like, we're only doing what they, what we allow them to do to us. We can change it. But everybody's so self-involved, and that's all created by the same people that are indoctrinating and controlling us. I mean, it's, it's, they've done a great job. I'm, I'm going to give them that. This plan has been laid out, and it's slowly, slowly implemented over time, right? Uh, income tax is against the Constitution. Literally, the federal government is breaking the law every time they institute federal income tax. Uh, state income tax, all of the income tax is, is illegal. But we pay it. And if we just said no, there was nothing they could do about it. For a successful business to, to grow and operate, which every city and every township and every... Uh, uh, yeah, every city and every township are corporations, right? So states, all, all of it. They're all corporations. And in order for a corporation to succeed, it has to be profitable. And, and, and you're the profit and I'm the profit. But if you say, and, and one of the things that I learned about business growth, right? You have to learn to say no. If you want to succeed, you have to learn to say no. So if, if the people want to succeed, we have to say no to tyrannical control. We have to say no to policies and force that make no sense that don't help anyone. Or, or we have to say no to a government that's using our money in the wrong way. It's not my responsibility. If I know my government is corrupt and they're going to use the money that I give them to do corruption, to do evil, it's not my responsibility to give them that money. 
If you're fixing to jab a whole bunch of people and kill millions of people, I don't owe you money. I'm not giving you money to do that, to, to fulfill your evil plans. I mean, think about that. You're responsible and I'm responsible. Love y'all.